Hi, I'm Terry Simons, and after 30 years in the restaurant business, I decided to make a career change, and I became a dog trainer and an agility competitor. Get it, get it, get it, get it, let's go. And this is my partner in crime and BFF, Ripper. We're gonna find the best dog-friendly restaurants, hotels, and adventures imaginable. So come hang your head out the window and join us as we travel doggy style. <laughs> yeah, I know, it was his idea. <laughs>to the Morrison pub. You're gonna love this place, Ripper. I hear they serve the dogs food off of silver platters. <laughs> no, 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 just because you're being served off a of silver platter does not make you a star. We're here at the Morrison pub where they treat dogs like Scottish royalty. I come to the Morrison because the food is great, it's dog friendly, and the drinks are the best. The dog friendly patio is great. How do you feel about the dogs? People love the dogs. We love the dogs here. We have dogs. We're very pet friendly, and we have the doggy menu, which is underneath. I the love the dog menu. menu. Exactly. exactly. I love it. You got. Where's the beef? Exactly. So it's gonna be rice with the beef, and then we have cockadoodle doo. It's gonna be rice with the chicken, and we make it fresh. <laughs> and then the same thing with the frankenweenie. That's gonna be chopped hot dog meat with rice. Too. Oh, jeez. Exactly. That's and exactly. you serve them on a silver platter. Serve them on a silver platter, mm -hmm. and then it comes with uh, three different uh, dog bones. They really know their dogs and they stick to the meat and the rice and it's, they, the dogs just loved it. Oh, sorry Ripper, this is mine. Yours, chicken and rice. Me, bacon bourbonator. So, you guys, you ordered the, the bread pudding? Right? Yes. I yes. it's like the best. We did. I mean, I mean, the ice cream's melting and it's bubbling at the same time. I'm like, that's like, it's not fair, is it? No, it's not fair to wait either. What's this? What's this? This is their caramel sauce that you can pour on top too. Do we pour on it or what do we do with that? So, I work it down a little bit, create a little couple So, you work it down by going like this? Yes. Okay, we're in, let's go. <laughs> You're not getting any ice cream. If you need a spot to hang out and have good food and drinks and have your dog, this is a perfect place. Just because the restaurant you're at is feeding your dog off a silver platter doesn't necessarily mean your dog should have bad table manners. And also, if the restaurant you're at doesn't have a dog-friendly menu, make sure what you order them is dog-friendly. And if not, bring along some treats to keep them happy. A happy dog is a happy diner. That's how we do it, doggy style. Easily the most popular burger is going to be the bacon burger, bacon bourbonator, excuse me, or the more. Have you been drinking? <laughs> then I had the filet mignon burger. <laughs> Can't even talk. <laughs> That's how good the drinks are. Ah, uh, yeah, there might be a poodle. No, you're not going to get lucky. No, no, I'm not wearing a kilt. I hear the sir. So we're off to the. <laughs> 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 okay. And whenever you're ready.